747 high I'm never choking, steady smoking like that Devin guy Or is it Wiz player, you know what it is I just rolling up with that fire and I take it to the wind Now I'm high as shit, high as shit And I'm rolling slow And I grab the Sprite, grab the Sprite And pull up some more Sipping Texas champagne Blowing California dro Yes, your body no sicko, man I got that Arizona flow All the smoke is that potent weed Also burning that platinum wax today YouTube, it's your boy GZ509 coming at you with a new video. You already know the deal. Hit the like, the subscribe, and the notification bell so you're notified anytime your boy GZ drops a video. A shout out to the real ones. I'll pray for the fake ones. Hope everyone was having a blessed day today. Today, your boy GZ, you already know by the thumbnail. <clears throat> um, we're going to go ahead and we're going to get into this review uh, on these Jim Red ones. Um, you know, shout out to Jeff Curtis, man. He let me go ahead and do a review on these. So, shout outs to him. Um, and let's get into it, man. So, uh, we'll go about, we'll read the, uh, excuse me. We'll read the style code. The style code says, Air Jordan 1 Retro High OG Black Gym Red White Sale. And suggested retail is $160. For that big foot motherfucker, 12 and a half. Unicorn size, guys. This box is huge. So, <clears throat> let's get into it. Legitness. You got the Nike receipt. Straight from Nike. Let's get into these. Let me grab the one that has the lace on it. That's the one I like to deal with. All right, guys. So, here we go, man. I've been late on this uh, review, so I apologize. But everybody has their review out and all that shit, but I'm still gonna drop my shit. But anyways, here you go, take a look at this. Looks really, really nice, guys. Uh, you know, I know a lot of people were feeling the shine on these, but that shine is not that bad, man. All Y'all forget, back in 1985, the shine on almost all the Jordan 1s had that real, real bright, bright shine on it, guys. You know what I mean? To me, it makes the shoes stand out and pop out a little bit more. The only thing I do wish they did is either they should have made this sale and this sale, keep it all the same, or if you're gonna keep this that bright white, you know, do the same thing to the sole, to the midsole. You know what I mean? That's the only complaint I had on this shoe. Um, the uh, leather is really, really, really soft. I like this leather right here. This leather is super, super soft, man. He, uh, he definitely got a good pair on this. Let's take this uh, in, insert out real quick. Throw that over there so we can see that softness and that, you know how I like to push on this leather, man. But it's real, real soft. The white is real soft. I can bear it to uh, probably, um, We'll say the Jordan 1 SBs as far as that white goes right there. These right here, I'll have to compare these to my shadows. My Jordan 1 shadows and uh, Sports Illustrated. But really, really nice shoe. You know you got your uh, Wings logo, Air Jordan right there with the basketball in the middle in that, uh, that white uh, color. Um, you got your uh, Nike Air in red on a white tag. And you got your black uh tongue really really nice shoe man to give you a option you could throw the red in uh i suggest you guys throw the red in i don't know if you guys looked at uh ets he put them on foot and they look dope as hell you know what i mean uh let's see you got a little bit of tumble leather i don't know if you guys can see that but uh yeah man you got a little bit of tumble leather on that swoosh um, overall, man, it's a really nice shoe, and you know about the black bottoms, man. Anytime they go with the black bottom on a Jordan 1, I fucking love it. I mean, it, it just makes the shoe that much more sick. Um, but, man, this shoe is very, very dope. Oh, man, I love the smell of Jordan 1s. Uh, but it's a nice shoe, man. Y'all drop something down in the comments, man. Let me know if you, uh, if you got these, you know. Uh, I know a lot of people weren't feeling the shine. But I have a feeling that people are gonna uh, are gonna regret passing on these. Uh, 
you know, there's a few other ones like the, what is it, the Man Ain't uh, Meant to Fly. Those come out in November, and then they have those ones. Um, what are they, the Defiant, OG Defiance, the one that has the swoosh ripped off. You know, I know people are going to probably try to go for those, but when those are going to be limited, I think. Um, you know, it's hard to say what shoes limited and what shoes not. So I think when people can't get those, they're gonna want to come back for these, and I don't think these are gonna be available like everybody thinks they are. I I want to say that they're not gonna end up in the outlet, but there might be a few sizes that end up in the outlet. Uh, but you know, my opinion on these shoes, I think they did a good job on these shoes uh, as far as the quality of the leather. The leather is really, really, really plush and real soft. Um, which I dig that anybody that likes Jordan ones they love that uh, I mean it's really really soft guys uh, but great quality on the shoe I like this the, the the whole look of it you know they always come with that black that white and that red when they put it all together and they make it mesh it, look, it pops guys I mean I love the way this shoe looks um, you know uh, another shoe that you know that has similarities to was the not for resales man and this is a good shoe for anybody that missed out on the uh, not for resales this would be a good shoe to get because I mean it's pretty much the damn same thing I don't know I never had a not for resale in my hand so I can't tell you how the quality is on that but from what everybody says they're fire the guys I'm telling you man this leather right here is 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 a one I mean everything on this shoe is a one you know you even got that pinchy pinch pinch shout out to shoe tube fpv but yeah man they got that nice little pinch on there it has a little bit of a shine guys but it's and like i said it's not that bad you know people you know overreact when they seen the shine now man when those shot when when those uh shattered backboards come out the 3.0s then we'll see you <laughs> then you guys can complain about the shine but man for these ones right here i think it's dope i like the way they came out it's a good concept pretty dope sneaker man so y'all let me know in the comments man were you guys feeling these did you guys pass or was this a cop or was this trash man i, I want to know your guys's opinion i always want to know your guys's opinions and thoughts on sneaker releases and uh, let me know. With that being said, your boy Jesus is going to end this video. I will give you guys some B-roll on this. Shout out to you guys. Much respect. Stay blessed. And on to the next. Peace. Play dead, mate. Thank you.